Hello and welcome to today's video. As you can see from the title, it is a makeup get ready with me for a wedding. So I'm going to my friend's wedding today and if we go back in time, you will see me getting ready from scratch. So get ready for a red nose. <laughs> So I've had a shower and dried my freshly washed hair. My nose is looking very red. I got sunburnt doing the Northern Tongariro circuit and it's peeling. So fingers crossed the makeup can cover up this Rudolph nose. But to start off, I'm just going to do my hair. I think I'm just, just gonna do kind of little curls with my straightener. I had two different friends offer me a ride and one will be running early and one will be running late. And looking at the time, I'm gonna be getting a ride with a late friend. Oh, that was hot. <laughs> oh. Usually I don't have these problems. I think it's because I'm using a different mirror. My sunburn has got progressively worse over the past couple of days to the point where I think my whole nose is peeled off. Like there's been, there's been a lot of peelage. So I've put this massive layer of moisturizer on right now and I'm hoping that it just doesn't peel off today. Maybe I should take some makeup to touch up just in case it all peels off. I officially have a burnt ear. We'll just add to the burntness of my general physique. Okay, I think we're gonna leave it there. Start on the makeup. Maybe come back to it if we have time. If not, we're just gonna go with it. For foundation, I'm going for the Chi Chi Fabulous and Flawless Foundation. Got this in a recent vlog. Really like it. Pretty much the only foundation that matches my skin tone. But now that I've got sunburned, who knows? Who knows what it's gonna do? We're just this is this is what we're going with. Let's get this mirror up in here and let's hope this works. I feel like today is a multi-foundation day. Like we're gonna coat her up. And my cheeks are peeling too. Awesome. This foundation is called Fabulous and Flawless. I'm not looking fabulous and flawless. I think this is the most foundation I've used in one go in my life. I am going to powder this with the Rimmel Stay Matte Powder and hope that this doesn't cling too badly to my sunburn. I feel like in the viewfinder I look like a total cake face. Maybe that's what I look like in real life. I can see all the peeling. Okay. For eyebrows I'm gonna start with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Homemade in Taupe. And I'm going to put a little bit of the Chi Chi Fiber Brow on top and try not to put too much on because I don't want to look too like brows. For contour I'm using the NYX blush in taupe. Oh dear, I didn't use the mirror. That was dumb. Who knows where that ended up. For blusher I am using the Milani blush in Luminous. I don't know how much blush I should be adding since my nose is red. Should I make my cheeks redder so my nose looks this red. For highlighter I'm using the Balmary Luminizer. It's very pretty but my compact has shattered so every time I open it I'm at risk of spilling it everywhere and making a giant mess. Since it's a special occasion we'll crack it out and get it cracked because <laughs> the makeup's cracked. I don't, I don't know what my hand's doing here. I never put on makeup like this because I have the mirror in my left hand. Next I am using probably my nicest makeup product in my entire collection. The By Terry Ombre Black Star in the color Misty Rock. It's like a pretty purpley shade. Just realized I'm putting on purple eyeshadow and I'm wearing a red dress. I think I'm gonna zoom you in since I'm doing eyes. Hello. So now I'm using an Estee Lauder palette. It's just got some pretty purple colors. I think I'm gonna try to use more of the brown though, now that I've remembered the color of my dress. So I just use that kind of brownie purpley shade and I think I'm just going to add some more dimension with my Naked 2 palette, put some more brown in there. I nearly threw my brush across the room. What I love about YouTube is my entire room is a mess right now. My bed is covered in stuff, but you can't see that. You think it's this beautiful floral thing. And for a sort of eyeliner -y effect, I'm going to be using this really dark brown called Busted and flick it out a bit, I think. And I'm going to blend it. So we're gonna mascara and then we're on the home stretch, which is good because I need to leave soon. This mascara is the 3D Magic Clash from Chi Chi. And I poke myself in the eye. Uh. Finally, for my lips, I am using the Clinique color thing? Color pop, Clinique pop. It is in the color Beach Pop and it is just kind of a neutrally nude shade which suits me because 
I'm gonna be eating. This one's also perfect at the moment because as you can tell from my peeling nose, my lips are also dry. And these are just so moisturizing. They kind of smooth over any chapped lips. It's great. I feel like I look ridiculous. This is too much. I think I'm gonna block the lipstick a bit. Final makeup look. So that's the final makeup look. I'm gonna go put on my dress. And Ellen's not here, so I don't know. Oh, Ellen's coming home. I can get her to film my dress. I can see her, yay!